everyone, Dina here with a quick tip on how to validate your HTML code. So when you're first starting out, it can be frustrating trying to get all the tags correct and see if you're using all the correct attributes, whether they're necessary. So you can go to um, a service by W3C, which is validator.w3.org. Now you can uh, validate by putting in a website address so if you have a if your website is already published and live on the web you can just put the HTTP uh, code you know URL in here but if you're just working at home and you're working locally you can choose your web file and upload it so one of the examples I've done is this how-to page and so you just click choose file click check and then you'll get some information here that tells you some some stuff. So uh, the character encoding was not declared. So I need to put that UTF-8 in in my uh, meta tag. That's what that error means. Uh, bad value. So it doesn't like my Google fonts because of this pipe um, character. So I can't really do anything about that because I'm using the the uh, the code that Google Fonts is giving me so I'm just gonna ignore that one for now uh, but then here this is just a warning so this is just giving you some information that might be useful so it says the type attribute for the style element is not needed and should be omitted so uh, it tells you exactly where that is line 7 I can go ahead and remove these and then I can check check my file again and see if it um, if those go away. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so here is my web page and so it was that UTF that I'm missing, so my character set. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in here. Hold on. Okay, it's meta care car set. And in the United States, English, it is UTF-8. So we're gonna go ahead and put that in. That should get rid of the one error. Like I said, I'm not gonna change this link to the Google fonts. And then the other thing was, said I don't need this style type equals text. CSS. So I'm going to go ahead and save this and then I'm going to run through my test one more time. Okay, so I'm going to go back to choose my file. This was just updated. I'm going to click open and check again. So now everything is has gone away except I still have that Google font error, um, which again I'm not going to do anything with. But let me show you if I left something off. Like let's say I'm going to go ahead and mess up some of this code here and see if I can get a lot of people make this mistake. They put image SCR instead of SRC. So let me go ahead and do that and see what happens with my file. Okay so here we've got that same error and then right here line error number two end tag header seen but there were open elements okay so that's because I didn't close my h1 and you'll notice here in brackets too there's a red there's like a red font and that usually means there is a problem with the line above it so that's the best place to start okay and then here it tells you again unclosed element h1 so if you can fix these problems they're going to go away attribute SCR not allowed on image so um, S element image is missing required attribute SRC so this will help you determine what might might some problems be with your web page and hopefully help you get to coding quicker and more efficiently and uh, using correct syntax thanks bye